Hi, it's Dr. Dan Curtis. And Lucy Curtis from Dyslexic and Unstoppable. Our mission is to help dyslexics rediscover their inner power. That's right. Um, and this is the next in our uh, 10 tips to help the struggling reader as you go back to school. Um, this one is um, about getting the first book as an audiobook. Um, and it's not always possible, but a lot of times it is. So how can that, that help them? Um, yeah, because it, they can, if you know the, what's the first book they'll be reading, you can get the audiobook and, and they can to do it to get at the same time, right? So they have to look at the words as they're listening to the audiobooks so that they can get a first look at what is going to be happening, right? And a lot of times there's, there's um, books online or books uh, that you can download or things like that right. so that you can start having an idea. You know, if it takes you, for me, like I look at my kids' books that they have to read for the summer and I'm like, discourage yeah. because I'm like I, I'm I'm not able that's just one book right. I, I would not I would have to work all day long right. um, and they have to read like five of those so if you can get ahead and start you know reading and right. getting in into it and, and figuring what the book is about then it helps you know yeah. and then if you can have for me if, if I can get a book on an audio I've I've read I've listened to so many books and I you know what's the difference I, I I read it or I heard it now I know what the book is about I can have a conversation with somebody right, you know, I it, right you get the information in um, the other thing I think it helps is um, I know back when he was really struggling in that first grade and into mm -hmm. second grade and everything like that um, he'd be reading the words and he would you know I'd be sitting mm -hmm. with him and it, he'd be sounding them out but. As he fights through each and every word, it's hard to piece the whole thing together and have it become a story. And therefore, it's hard for him to um, to kind of get into the story, right? That's that's you know. Or anyone... understand what the paragraph is about. Right, so right. you're constantly redoing the same thing over right and over. over. Yeah, and so you don't have. But if you're able to listen to it the first time through, get the gist of the story, then you can be like, okay, this is this part. So now now I know what's going to happen in this part. So. As I'm reading it, as in, even though I'm kind of struggling with it, it kind of keeps you into the story and keeps you want to, you know, move on and, and find out what happens next in the story. Mm -hmm. um, so just a way that audiobooks can help your child is is uh, one of the tips to go back to school. All right, um, we'll move on to the next one, and um, please leave us a comment below.